Schalke's second and final match of the Florida Cup took them to Fort Lauderdale to face Brazilian side Atletico Mineiro. New signing Alessandro Schupf was put into the starting lineup by Royal Blues coach Andre Breitenreiter. Schalke were convincing 2 0 winners over Fort Lauderdale strikers in their first match, but they were a goal down inside 10 minutes against the Brazilians. Leonardo Silva rose highest from the first corner of the game. Too easy for the big central defender, the Bundesliga side had a battle on their hands. It was going to require a fight back. Just a couple of minutes later and Schalke took aim. Eric Maxim Schupermoting's header was good but not great, but enough for Victor to spill the ball to Junior Kaysara. The first opportunity on 10 minutes. Schalke's Brazilian rattled the post, but not ripped the net of his countrymen. The best further opportunity from the Royal Blues to draw level came on 38 minutes. Schalke were growing in strength and Denis Ayogo's cross almost turned home by Leon Goretzka. An equaliser wouldn't have been undeserved. But as it was, it was Atletico Mineiro who went in a goal to the good. Brazil won, Germany nil. Schalke changed things up at the break with seven new players and needed a spark from somewhere and they found it from Yunus Belonda. A Moroccan international and new signing had a decent chance to open his Royal Blue account. After 74 minutes against Mineiro, at least he tested the keeper. It was followed up by an even better chance to level things up. Leroy Sane's pressure and that led to a penalty. There is certainly a question mark about if it should have been given against Atletico's Ed Carlos, but still an opportunity for Schalke. Johannes Geis took responsibility, but he was denied by Victor and failed with the follow-up. The Brazilian keeper held his nerve when Geis didn't. Would that be the best chance that Schalke would get? That left the door open for Mineiro to see off the match. They put their foot down to get the result. A couple of minutes after the penalty miss, Patrick doubled the Atletico lead. The Royal Blues looked out of sorts and were punished for it. A lovely trip from Patrick on 81 minutes. But the best was yet to come from the team from Belo Horizonte. Individual skill is something that South American players are famous for, and that was shown by Lucas Candido. A rocket that no keeper was going to get close to. A real bullet. It remained 3-0. One win and one defeat for Schalke in the Florida Cup. They returned to Germany after a decent workout from their American adventure.